For now, we will focus on the sun storage dams. Uh, we already saw a video of, uh, of IBM and Sasol on, on sun storage dams, so you all have an idea what we're talking about. But still some pictures. During the wet season, the river is flowing, and the, the sand dam doesn't uh, obstruct the river flow. During the dry season, we have the sand storage dam, with behind it the, the sand aquifer, in which the, the groundwater is stored. So that means that uh, a sand storage dam will contribute to bridging the dry periods, uh, making water available not only for domestic use, but also for irrigation. When it comes to our country, it's a paradox to have a country with a abundant water resources to suffer with recurrent droughts and flood. Currently, about 40 million of the total population of the country doesn't have clean water access and the sanitation situation is extremely low. In Ethiopia, to cope up with the urgent need of water resource development, rainwater harvesting and implementation network system would play a very impera imperative role. Further, using simple Sustainable community-based te technologies could enhance the development of water resources as well. And the coverage of water supply, for particularly for the rural poor, is not attainable if only we leave the things for the government. We have to focus, in fact, on such low-scale technologies whereby the people themselves using their local knowledge, using materials available within uh, the area they are living in and uh, develop systems that can be constructed, designed and operated by themselves. The success factor is predominantly that you can hold your water which is available but only during a short period and you can uh, store the water and use it in dry periods. I mean that's the success factor and the success factor of the technique further is it's simple. People can construct them themselves. It's fairly cheap. Uh, maintenance costs are low. We, at the universities, cannot say if there will be more rain or less rain. The thing we do know is that the period of uh, rain will become shorter. So you will have days with a lot of rain, and then it will stop and it will be dry for a longer time. True various experts from Africa and the Netherlands, which are now with us, I would like to call everyone to stand in support of the efforts of the program professionally, financially, technically, and through advisory means in the various initiatives in the sector so as to minimize water stress and improve the socio-economic well-being of our people.